Oh, yeah. It is mail day today. I'm Ian. Welcome back to the garage. This is Ian doing stuff. Uh, hmm. This box. It's got the goods in it. Possibly my one of my top like three or four videos right now is the video of me with the blower attachment on my uh, Ryobi. Let me let me just let me get this thing. Here you go. This right here. <laughs> my Ryobi expanded. This is probably one of my um, one of the top videos. And, I mean, if, as you can tell, I still use this thing. I use it all the time. Use it every week. Um, whenever you know grass clippings, all whatever that kind of stuff like that. But we actually have a hedge, and what I have been using, I'm going to show you something else. This is what I have been using to trim my hedges. And what I have to do is I have to, like, get, uh, I'm going to run a cable and all that stuff. So it, it's just dumb. I, I don't want to do that. I've got this, the weed eater, and the reason I got this is because it has all these attachments. So I finally got another attachment in the mail. This one has been long overdue. I was, I was asking Kendra, I was like, can I just buy this thing? So it was, uh... About $100 from Home Depot. It's like a cuss. They've got a couple different options, and I went with this one. But let's give it a go. Oh, yeah, the, the CRKT, my new knife. Still rocking this thing, really loving it. Fits in my pocket really nice, really easy to use. All of a sudden, all right, let's see what's got. What's that? Okay. Here we go. It's still a little hard to, to close, but. Oh yeah, the box is, this is a cool, it's a cool looking box that this came in. Ooh, the kids will like that one. All right, in the box, there's not much because it just is an attachment. <laughs> in the box is my, ooh, doggy, oh doggy. That's trash, that's trash. Is the hedge trimmer attachment for my weed eater this thing is so cool it has uh the reason i went with this one it's a shorter it's a shorter blade i think it's a 15 inch blade uh this, this is uh oh well this I think it said 15 inches which i i'm 15 inches from thing to thing 15 inches there this one is what does it say? like 18 inches, whatever. They they've got a they've got another one. The other one's a little bit longer, but what the other one doesn't have that this has is this one has a articulating head. I've never used this before, so oh, a little safety, a little safety clip down here. Open up the safety clip, push this down. It's got a 90 degree. Holy cow, that's cool. Look at that. You can go past, you can go past 90 degrees. Oh man, that feels really, I mean, this, this feels really solid. It does not, it does not feel like cheap. That does not feel like cheap metal. All this whole mechanism thing feels really nice, but you can really get it at the right angle. That's really easy to use, feels really secure. Let's get this little sheath off. Oh yeah, look at that. So like I said, the other one, um, the other option, which you can just get on Amazon and everything, is uh, um, it's, a, it's a little cheaper. It's like $68, $69 or something like this. This one was a, it's $100. The other one, had it's a little bit longer, but it doesn't articulate like this. And that is the reason I articulate it. So it's super easy. Push the safety in, push this, go to where you want it. So there's that. That's really cool. What else do we have in here? Anything else? Um, blah, blah, blah. Operator's manual. Pretty much this thing, we just attach it and go for it. So let's attach it. Um, there's like nothing, there is nothing in the box. Super simple. All right. Let's attach it. This, this is why this stuff is so cool. I, I really like. Hmm. 
coffee. Ooh, I'm doing I'm doing the toddy coffee. There's a single origin uh, Ethiopian yogurt chef. Oh, dude, it's freaking delicious. Here we go. This thing right here. So simple. This little knob right here. Twist the knob. Push the button in. That comes right out. Set that there. This thing goes right in here. I don't want to spill my coffee. I'm trying to be too simple. I don't want too gentle. I don't want to spill my coffee. There it goes. Okay. Get a nice tap down. And there you go. Look at that. That thing is ready to trim some hedges. And we can. It's kind of awkward to do it when it's attached to it. But oh, I can do it. Oh yeah, look at that. That's cool. So you can do your head just straight up and down. So you don't have to like hold this thing in a weird. You don't have to hold this thing in a weird angle. There we go. <laughs> Look at that. Uh, I gotta go do some. You know what I may... So this is what I got here versus this. I mean, this thing is a whole lot smaller and lighter than this whole thing, but I may go and see which one can get the job done quicker on the shrubs. So, let's. I gotta get my extension cable, make sure this thing's fueled up, and we will go to the front and do this thing. Don't, don't wanna forget the coffee. There you go. I've got gas down here. I've got all my power over here. I'm gonna fill up with gas, run my power, and see how long it takes me to do both sides. We'll see what happens. <laughs> Just ran out of gas. All right, let's get this thing going.
whale. It's about 10 minutes for me to do just about all of that on that one, on that one side, start to finish. So now I'm gonna use the electric one and see how long it takes me to do the electric one. You gotta start by plugging this thing up. And also because of how far I have to go, I've gotta do two extension cords. So I've gotta do one extension cord to get it down there. And I have my second extension cord that I use for that. So we've gotta run two cords. That's cord one. This thing to keep this from stopping, you have to, you know, put this thing in here like this. That locks, and you can plug this in. So theoretically, you shouldn't be able to pull that out. I'm gonna tie a knot on the other side too. That way. It's not Well, we're back in the garage now after doing a little bit of work. Uh, did these side by side. Um, the new one took about 10 minutes. The old one took about 10 minutes. So timing of everything was about the same. So the setup on the electric one is I have to use two extension cords. So I use the two extension cords. I go out there to strategically drop the thing and we use we use this thing. What's what is nice about this thing is it's pretty small and it's it's really easy to like to work and the shape and to get stuff with my hedges, um, it's kind of hard to get on some of the things because I might, I, I'm all at the, the extent of this. Like I can't go any further than my arms. Um, and so, yeah, so it's, it's good. It's good to use. It's like what you, what you'd expect. Um, I, I don't like using the cord. That is like, I just don't like using the cord. Um, this thing, this thing is this weighs is about as much as that and with it all together it's really heavy so it's a it's a it's a heavy it's a heavy unit um i found this to be pretty convenient when i was doing the ups the the vertical sections of it i was able to do this and so i didn't have to get my weed eater in some like in some funky position and it was nice that it's longer and so it's a lot easier to do longer like fur further out further out sections on my on my shrubs um, what I did notice is, well, I did run out of gas. So I ran out of gas. I didn't start with a full tank of gas on the weed eater. My can ran out of gas, so I didn't really start with a full tank. I ran, I ran out of gas. Um, I found this one harder to actually use than this one, mainly because of the weight. It's really heavy. It's really heavy to run it. And with a variable, uh, speed control on the handle, you're really having to like, you, you got a lot of you got a lot of control on how fast the things can go, but man, this thing is really, really heavy and kind of hard to use. Uh, so on the ease of use between the two, this thing tool is actually a lot easier to use than than this tool is. The convenience is this tool is a lot more convenient to use than this because it already works in your whole system. You're not running. Um, maybe the ideal tool would be something like this. That's that's battery powered because it's light and it's easy to use and you don't have to like, but because I'm going to use this because I've got it and it's all part, it's a part of the system. Um, but if I would have, I think, I think that middle ground, having that one more here, that was a battery powered one, maybe, maybe the way to go, but pick one up, use one for yourself. Tell me what you think. I'd be interested 
to hear your guys' thoughts. I love hearing what you guys have to say. If you've got thoughts or questions or anything, just put those down in the comments. I love reading and responding to, to all of those. If you like this, please subscribe, please like, do all those things. Um, and thank you for watching, and we will see you here next time.